It's the two and three seeds meeting with the winner advancing to take on the Lady Bears of Baylor as we take a look at the bracket. And veteran play, the four seniors for Texas, I think have the edge. You know, in picking out advantages, it's hard to say which team has an advantage. 15-footer, she'll take it, and she'll make it. She has the ability to hit that oh, shot. Yeah. I'm not sure why she hesitated when she first received it. It was just going to reverse the basketball. Imagine it. Coaching staff and the players very impressed with her ability just to kind of put it aside for now. Brewer, the running right-hander. Final five seconds of the quarter. Brooke McCarty. Got the opening, got the shot, got the lead for Texas number five. Well, she had a terrific game yesterday in the oh, quarterfinals, yeah. didn't she? I loved her energy. At pins, nothing but the bottom of the net. Didn't allow that long looping, skipping, skip court pass. Rodrigo the long three, rips the net. That's, that's when you make something out of nothing. Holmes, despite the good defense by Higgs, West Virginia can get a couple of stops here. It'd be interesting to see what happens. McCarty opens up the scoring with the three. She's got 11 in the ball game. Third game in three days. And all the coaches talk about that. Stroman, by the way, on the quick layup, and Martin answers with a jumper of her own. Can't get those shots to go. And here's the breakaway by Foman. And the lead is extended to 23 with 30 seconds left to play in the third. Game now for the Longhorns at 25. Once again, the winner of this game will meet Baylor. Final two seconds of the third. Muldrow, yes, at the buzzer. And Morton, nice dish to Bria Holmes. Ken Buzz loses the handle, but Morton comes up with it. Morton gives it up. Muldrow, 4 3. And Page. Nice job overplaying by Morton. She'll have a path to the hoop and makes him pay. Lee recover to that to that loss. Well, they recover. They have recovered in such a way that they've had two strong showings here, mm -hmm. especially here in the semifinals. At Down to 14. Texas has allowed West Virginia to chip into this. That stopped by the jumper from Jordan Hosey. With 15 on the shot clock, Muldrow shot off the mark. The return by Morton, who's played an outs. And that's going to do it. The Texas Longhorns will advance to the finals against Baylor. That'll be tomorrow night at 9 o'clock.